Hi, who have I got here? Nice of you to join me on Saturday, Sunday. It's not Saturday, is it? Sunday, our new time at 6.30 in the Spanish time zone. Have I got Alex there? Alex is always there. If you are Alex, hello to you. And today was a very, very special day in Spain. I don't know about the rest of the world, but today it was a special day for the children. Why was it a special day for the children? Hi there, Anna Kasha. Nice that you've joined us on Sunday evening. Is it nearly bedtime? It's not too late for you, is it? It's half past six in the evening. Yeah. What time do you go to bed? Hmm? Do you go to bed soon? This can be a bedtime story. And why was it a special day for you children today? Oh, no, you don't have to go to bed. Anna Cash is telling me she doesn't have to go to bed yet. Good, 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 good. good. <laughs> it was a special day because you were allowed out to play, wasn't you? Ah, oh, you got to bed at nine o'clock. Oh, OK, we've got lots of time. I can take my time, can't I? Have you been doing nice things today? You've been doing nice things every day. I've seen some of your artwork. It is amazing. It's beautiful. You went to the promenade, promenade, to the promenade for a stroll. Did you bring your scooter with you? Or a bicycle or anything to play on? Yeah, I bet you enjoyed your special day today outside. Hopefully you'll get more of that every day for an hour. And then soon it will be like it was before that you can go out all the time. Who have I got on my lap? Do you know who I've got on my lap? I'll show you the top of their head. Do you know who that could be? Oh, <gasps> did you see? Who was that? Who is it's DJ Shimmy. I've got DJ Shimmy on my lap today. He's wearing something special, something colourful. And you guys have seen it before if you were here Friday. It's a paper. Why are you wearing a paper chain, a colourful paper chain? To go with the story. To go with the story. What story did I say I was going to do? Do you know the name of the story that I'm doing today? It was about an elephant, wasn't it? And he was very colourful as well. Kind of like this, but not quite, not quite. <laughs> The DJ, yes, you're right, DJ Shimmy. Hello, Anna Kasha. Thank you for joining us. And we're going to read this book today. Elmer, can you see Elmer there? He's camouflaged, the patchwork elephant. It's lots of beautiful colours. Some of you might know Elmer, and DJ Shimmy tried to dress up like him. It's okay, it's better than what I could do. I've put on these colours today. Hope you like my colours. <laughs> but first, we're going to have the hello song. The elephant, Anna Kasha, I love your memory. You're like, yeah, elephants, they have good memories. Your memory is like an elephant. You never, ever, ever forget. A bit like me, I never forget, do I? Never, ever. <laughs> so DJ Shimmy, you get your patchwork self over there and turn on the hello song. Can I see your hands? Have you got your hands ready? We're going to say hello. How are you today? If I can, yeah, this one. Still got to get used to my new keyboard. Here we go. Are you in the dancing mood? You can click your fingers if you like. Can you click your fingers like this? Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? How are you today? How are you? I'm fine, thank you. I'm fine, thank you. I'm fine, thank you. How are you today? Let me hear you. Are you okay? Are you fine? You had a good day? Yeah, I know I did. I had a lovely day. Beautiful weather, isn't it? Hmm. Are you ready for some questions? And Akasha, you're very, very good at questions. So these, yeah, you, you're going to find these so easy. Who? Oh, I've got another message from one to a hundred, from one to a hundred. Cheryl, yeah, I'm here. I went to Caredi. Where did you go? <laughs> Carretera de las Aguas. Wow, did you go there? I've been there. Alex took me there when I was babysitting and it's very nice up there. I hope you had a really nice time. And is your name from one to a hundred? It says from one to a hundred. Nice name. Very unusual. <laughs> I'm going to ask you some questions about the days of the week. The days of the week, oh, this should be easy. 
You know your days of the week, don't you? You do? Okay, here's question number one for you. Which day of the week is named in honour of the moon? What day is in honour of the moon? Did you know there was an, a day of the week and it's in honour of the moon? What day could that be? What days do we have? Is it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday? Karedi Hachisom. 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 That's the name of the road, Hachisom. That sounds very unusual. Oh, yeah, yeah, he saw him. Oh, it's in Catalan, isn't it? That means we are here or something, doesn't it? Translated. I've been to that road, actually. I remember seeing it and thinking, what an unusual name for a road. I've been there. Did you see me? Yeah? <laughs> now I've got some answers here. Some people say it's, what's that, Sunday? Monday, says Anna Kasha. Javier says, hello. Hello, Javier, hello. <laughs> so the day that is in honour of the moon is Monday, lunes. Lunes is like the moon in Spanish, isn't it? Lunes, luna, Monday, moon. Yes, it was Monday. Alexander. Oh, okay. It's Alex. You've got a new name there. That's why I didn't realise it was you. Hello, Alex. <laughs> So which day of the week is named in honour of a Greek god after whom the sixth planet from the sun is also named? That was a long question, wasn't it? So a Greek god is named after this, this planet. It's the sixth planet from the sun. What? No, what day is that? What day is it? What day of the week is named in honour of a Greek god to the sixth planet of the next from the sun. <laughs> oh, this is a long question. It's also named after. Do you know that day of the week? It's a Greek god's name. And it's also the sixth planet from the sun. What day is that? Do you know? It begins with an S. That's a big clue, isn't it? <laughs> Tuesday, no. The sixth, what planet is sixth from the sun? You've got Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, you, you uh, Neptune at the end. <laughs> yes, you got it. No, wait there, wait there. I've got lots of different answers. I've got Saturday and Sunday. One of those answers are right. It is Saturday. Saturn. Saturn is a name of a Greek god. And that is the meaning of Saturday, Sabado in Spanish. Yeah, you guys got it now. Excellent. Well done. The last question. These ones are hard, aren't they? The last question. Which day of the week is named in honour of the Germanic god of thunder? It's also the Norse god of thunder. The Germanic god of thunder. Do you know which day of the week that could be? Carolina and Valentina. Oh, OK. I said half year. That must be your daddy's name. Carolina, Valentina. Nice to see you. Well, I can't see you. Nice that you've joined us. Oh, wow. And Akasha, these are too easy for you and your daddy, aren't they? <laughs> and I love those emojis. One moment. I have to eat these emojis. I've got two oranges, a pineapple, an apple and a hamburger. Thank you for those emojis. You guys knew this question. Thursday. And what is the name of that Greek god, the Greek god of thunder? He carries a big hammer and he goes boom with his hammer. Do you know his name? If you like Marvel cartoons, you would know his name. <laughs> it is Thor. Thor. Did you know that? The Greek god of thunder is Thor. And that is why we have Thursday. It's named after him. Thor Thursday, kind of. <laughs> so here is an action for you to do after the video. You keep a diary for a week saying what you did every day. On Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah? If you get bored, I'm bored. Who said that? Was it you? <laughs> then you can try and keep a diary and write down everything that you did every day for one week. That is easy. And I've got some emojis sent to me. What is that? Oh, 
Oh, a night, a mountain and a cabin. Okay, I will go and live there after we're allowed to go even further outside. Thank you for that. <laughs> I'm going to ask you the tongue twister. We've done this tongue twister before. I want to see if you can say it now. Maybe you've been practicing and can say it now. So you ready for a tongue twister? Where's your tongue? Quick, twist it. Don't really twist it, just pretend, okay? <laughs> Don't really twist your tongue. This is this tongue twist. I'm going to read it first. A big black blood blue 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 bubbles. Did you understand that? Because I didn't. Let me say that again. A big black blood blue 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 blub. Oh, I can't say it. Let's see if you can say it. Can you say that? If you're with a grown up and you can't read, I'll send to say it 10 times and I'm going to keep quiet. <gasps> Noah, hello, Noah. <laughs> Noah's just joined us. Did you say it? Did you say it better than I did? Let me try it one more time, slowly. I have to say it in slow motion, okay? Can I say it in slow motion? A big black bug blue, big blue bubbles. Oh, that was easy. It was easy peasy lemon squeezy, wasn't it? Hmm. <laughs> what did you put there, Alex? Wow. Once. Once. You said it once. Was it easy? Was that one? It's too easy, isn't it? I have to get harder ones. Did you learn the flags? Remember I showed you these flags and I said, learn these flags because I'm going to ask you on Sunday. What flag is that? What country is that? That is a flag from a country up north in Europe. What country could that be? Have I got it the right way round? No, I haven't. <laughs> this way. Begins with a D. Anybody know? Let me hear if I can hear you. <gasps> Whoa, some of you guys know. Yeah. I'm getting answers through and they're right. If anyone is saying Barcelona, they're wrong. Spain. It's not Spain. Did you say Spain? No. <laughs> yes, you're saying it now. Denmark. Denmark is not Spain, is it? You, we done Spain last time. You knew what Spain was. Spain was easy. And this one. The right way round. What, what Nordic country could that be? Begins with an S. And it's very famous because of a certain shop. And Noah, hello, and Noah. Nice of you to join us. Oh, fantastic. Let me see these. Oh, Nakasha's sending me such beautiful emojis. Now, ah, we, we got, will we get the answer for this? Aha, Alex has said the answer. So has Anakasha. Yes, it is Sweden. Sweden. If you said Sweden, you are right. And if you didn't, now you know. This one. This one begins with an N. All these countries are very close to each other. They're all in Europe, up north, where it is a bit cold. Might be sunny now, though. We're having lots of sun over here, thank goodness. This one begins with an N. Did you learn this one? Yeah, oh, too easy. If you said, like Anakash is saying here and Alex and everyone else is shouting out at home, Norway, you are right. That was Norway. Are you going to remember all of these? Remember, I carry these flags around in my pocket. And if I bump into you, I'll, I will say, what country is that? Norwega. This one was Norway. In Spanish, Norwega. Valentina, Carolina are just putting their answer through. Yes, you are right. And this one, they all look very similar, don't they? It's so confusing for me, but not for you guys. I know it's not confusing for you. This one begins with an I, with an I. With an I. Do you know this one? It is... Oh, 
oh, good guesser, Noah, but no, it's not, not that one. No, yeah, oh, some of you know, if you said what I'm seeing here, Iceland, you are right. Iceland. We got one more, one more. We're doing a lot today, aren't we? This one. What flag is that? What country could that be? It begins with an F. An F. Liam and family are watching. Mwah. Liam and Olive and your mummy and daddy. Nice to see you. Nice that you're tuning in. Did you have a good day? Did you go outside? This one is yes, 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 yes. I'm getting all your answers through. And I bet you knew, Liam, you're really good at your flags. I've seen that beautiful map that you have where you scratch off all the places you've been to. Tenerife and Finland? It's only one of those, Alex. It is Finland. So now you can distinguish all of these, can't you? You can, can't you? I can't. <laughs> I'm going to have to keep learning. Yeah, we've done all those. We've done a lot today. A lot, a lot, a lot. Are you ready for a game? A great game of seeing double. Double. Oh, I thank you for those emojis. Cool. Nice. I'm going to show you a picture. Some of you, got, if you were watching last week, you know this game. You ready? Good. Carolina and Valentina ready. I'm going to show you these two cards. There is something that is the same on both of these cards. For instance, you see all these things on the other card? There is only one thing that is the same on the other card. And I'm going to give you five seconds. Yes, I'm that generous for you to see what two things are the same. Are you ready? Are you ready? Wait there, let me see. Let me see my. Oh, I can see it. I can see it. Let's see if you can see it. Are you ready? Go. One, two, three. Four, five. Did you see what was the same on both cards? Did you see? I'm going to wait for some answers. I didn't do it too fast, did I? <gasps> you did see. <laughs> yes, Noah and Anoa. You saw. Did everyone else see? You? Oh, you. Yeah. The. How do you see that so quick? This, the fire. Ouch, it's hot. Ouch. You see, it's on both cards. Well done. Well done. <sighs> How close are you to this screen? How do you see that so quick? Let me see. I'm going to see. Oh, this one's difficult. You're never going to guess this one. Probably will, actually. Okay, five seconds. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five. Ha <laughs> ha, got you there. Did you see what was the same on both cards? didn't did you what you did you probably did didn't you <gasps> yes you did <laughs> well done noah yes you were right how you see that so quick you've got good eyes yes 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 <laughs> i can see all your questions coming up there it was the the hand that is the only thing that is on both cards Goodness gracious me. You've got very good eyes. Can I borrow your eyes? <laughs> so I think it's time for a jokey riddle. Are you ready for a jokey riddle? Let's see if you're ready for a jokey riddle. Oh, this one is hard. You're never going to know the answer to this jokey riddle. What hand is it better to write with? What hand is it better to write with? This one of the I don't know I did. You tell me what hand is it better to write with? Hmm. And Noah says the right hand. I'm left-handed. That's not fair. Let's see. Anyone else know what hand is better to write with? Left. Yes, I like that one. Right. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you you want to tell me you the answer? Yeah. Hey, it rhymes. <laughs> what hand is better to write with? Write rhymes. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> neither. Neither hand. Because it is better to write with a pencil. 
<laughs> you don't write with your hand, can you? you? You have to write with a pencil. So it's neither hand, pencil. Yeah? <laughs> Are you ready for the story? We're going to find out all about Elmer. And Anoa just said, what? <laughs> I asked you, what hand is it better to write with? And it's neither hand. Because you don't write with your hand, you write with your pencil. It's better to write with a pencil, not with your hand. Yeah, I know, it's terrible, isn't it? It's terrible. And Anoa's saying, yay, story. <laughs> Anyone know this story? Elmer. Elmer the colourful elephant. There he is. Looks beautiful, doesn't he? Nice and colourful. <gasps> That's a thing you can do if you say, I'm bored. You can draw a nice picture of Elmer and colour him so nicely. Can you do that? Yeah, if, if you're wondering what you can do next, you can do a nice picture. Maybe tomorrow, because it might be a bit late now. Have you had your, your dinner yet or your supper? Yeah, maybe you can do a, picture, a nice colourful picture of Elmer. He looks like that. That's a nice thing to draw. You have Elmer in French. Wow. Ah, so you know this story. Maybe you know this story in French. Wonder which one's Elmer. Don't think he's there yet. Can you see a colourful elephant? I see this one, but it's just a different colour of grey. That can't be Elmer. There was once a herd of elephants. Elephants young, elephants old, elephants tall or fat or thin. Elephants like this, that or the other. All different, but all happy and all the same colour. All that is except Elmer. Where is he? Aha, there he is. This one's Elmer. He looks very, very different, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Elmer was different. Elmer was patchwork. Elmer was yellow and orange and red and pink and purple and blue and green and black and white. <gasps> Whew. Elmer was not elephant colour. He's definitely not elephant colour, is he? Elephants are normally, what colour are elephants normally? They're normally silver. Grey, yeah, they're grey, aren't they? It was Elmer who kept the elephants happy. Sometimes he joked with the other elephants. Sometimes they joked with him. But if there was even a small smile, it was usually Elmer who started it. He likes to have fun with the elephants and make them laugh. You see there? Ooh, they turned him upside down. <laughs> One night, Elmer couldn't sleep for thinking. And the thing that he was thinking was that he was tired of being different. Whoever heard of a patchwork elephant, he thought. No wonder they laugh at me. In the morning, before the others were really awake, Elmer slipped quietly away, unnoticed. Can you see? Look, all the elephants are sleeping or falling asleep. And where's Elmer going? He's going somewhere. He says he doesn't like being different. I think he looks very nice. Do you? Yeah, he looks nice, doesn't he? Wonder what he's going to do. As he walked through the jungle, Elmer met other animals. And they always said, good morning, Elmer. Each time, Elmer smiled and said, good morning. Can you see all the animals? What animals can you see? Yeah. Yep. And this one, what's that? One? Yeah. And this one? Oh, that one nearly got my finger. And there's another one. After a long walk, Elmer found what he was looking for, a large bush, a large bush covered with berries, a large bush covered with elephant coloured berries. Elmer caught hold of the bush and shook it and shook it so that the berries fell on the ground. What colour are the berries? It said they're elephant colour. So they must be, yep. Grey berries. Oh, Noah's telling me all the animals that she saw. A turtle. I've just got to let you know. I think this one is a tortoise. Do you know the difference between a tortoise and a turtle? 
The turtle is the one that swims in the sea and the tortoise is the one that walks on the land. But many people call them the same tortoise turtle, but the tortoise is the one that's on the land. So he's shaking. Yes, got your answer, Alan. Thank you. The grey berries. Shake, 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 shake. What's he going to do with those grey berries? Once the ground was covered in berries, Elmer lay down and rolled over and over this way and that way and back again. Then he picked up bunches of berries and rubbed himself all over, covering himself with berry juice Ooh. until there wasn't a sign of any yellow or orange or red or pink or purple or blue or green or black or white. When he had finished, Elmer looked like any other elephant. Can you see him rolling in the berries? He's covering himself in grey berry juice. It's like paint. What's he going to look like? He looks like any other elephant now. Can you see him? That is Elmer. Can you believe that is Elmer now? Looks very different. After that, Elmer set off back to the herd. On the way, he passed the other animals again. Let's see if they recognise him. This time, each one said to him, good morning, elephant. <gasps> they didn't recognise him. They didn't say good morning, Elmer. They said good morning, elephant. And each time Elmer smiled and said, good morning, pleased that no one, oh, pleased that he wasn't recognised. Yeah, they didn't know it was him. When Elmer rejoined the other elephants, they were all standing quietly. None of them noticed Elmer as he worked his way to the middle of the herd. Hmm, which one could be Elmer? He's in the middle somewhere. Hmm, you, you think it's this one? Would that be Elmer? Covered in, in the grey berry juice. Oh, I think it could be him, yes. After a while, Elmer felt that something was wrong. But what? He looked around. Same old jungle, same old bright sky, same old rain cloud that came over from time to time. And lastly, same old elephants. Elmer looked at them. You know, they're all serious. I think he's thinking, oh, it's quite boring. No one's laughing. You know what's going to happen? Let's see what's going to happen. The elephants were standing absolutely still. Elmer had never seen them so serious before. The more he looked at the serious, silent, still standing elephants, the more he wanted to laugh. Finally, he couldn't bear it no longer. He lifted his trunk and at the top of his voice, he shouted. This one must be Elmer. Can you see? What's he going to shout? He's going to shout something. He's going to shout. Boo! Oh, can you see? A big boo. I think he scared the elephants. There he is. Boo! Can you say it? Let me hear you say it. <gasps> say it again. Boo! As loud as you can. <gasps> oh, you're loud. <laughs> the elephants jumped and fell, always in surprise. Oh, my gosh and golly, they said, and then saw Elmer, helpless with laughter. Oh, that was a big jump. If you shouted boo, I think you scared them as well. Look. <laughs> They've fallen all over the place. Elmer, they said. It must be Elmer. Then the other elephants laughed too. And they laughed as they had never laughed before. How do elephants laugh? You tell me. Tell me how elephants laugh. You make an elephant now noise laughing. I think they would go. As they laughed, the rain cloud burst. And when the rain fell on Elmer, his patchwork started to show again. Oh, look, it's starting to rain. And the rain's washing off the berry juice. The elephants still laughed as Elmer was washed back to normal. Oh, Elmer, gasped the old elephant. You've played some good tricks, but this one has to be the biggest laugh of all. It didn't take you long to show your true colours. We must celebrate this day 
every day of the year, said another. This will be Elmer's Day. Oh, they're to celebrate just one day of the year and they're going to call it Elmer's Day. All elephants must decorate themselves and Elmer will decorate himself elephant colour. Hmm. So all the elephants have to colour their selves and Elmer has to paint himself grey. That's a good idea, isn't it? That is exactly what the elephants do. On one day of the year, they decorate themselves and parade. On that day, if you happen to see an elephant, ordinary elephant colour, you will know it must be Elmer. How nice. Can you see all the elephants? They look beautiful. Which one would you like to be? This can be Carolina and Valentina. That can be Liam and Noah. Noah. This can be you. That can be you. That can be you. That can be you. And this one can be me. <laughs> and which one's Elma? Can you see Elma? Is that one Elma? This one. Yeah, that one's Elma. Oh, my cat is talking again. Kitty cat, are you okay? I don't know if you can hear kind of chirping noise in the background. If you can, I have not got birds. It's my cat doing bird impressions, or I don't know what my cat is doing. The grey one, Elma. You want to be that one. Everyone wants to be Elma. You don't want to be these pretty colourful ones. Yeah, after the video, you try and draw one of these elephants. They're beautiful, aren't they? And what day of the year is going to be their day for the parade? Maybe it can be this day. What day is this? Because it's also the special day that you guys were allowed out. Yeah, it is. What's the day? The 26th. April the 26th can be the day of the parade for the elephants. It's our special day. OK. And how many days have we been in lockdown for? Do you guys know? According to my calculations, we have been in lockdown for 40 days, 42, 42 days. It's a long time, isn't it? Yeah, but you've been doing lots of stuff, haven't you? And learning lots. And that was our story for today called Elma. And next Saturday, Sunday, who said Saturday? <laughs> next Sunday at half past six in the evening, Spanish time, we will have this story. Uh, Nancy goes to lunch. It's a folklore tale. It's a story, a folklore story from West Africa, and it's about a spider who's half man and half spider. Spider-Man. It's not the Spider-Man that you guys know. This is a different type of Spider-Man. It's about Nancy, and he's going to go to lunch. We're going to have that story next week. Are you ready for a song? We're going to do a song for the little ones. Yeah, it is 42 days. Everyone's putting 42 days. It is, isn't it? It's gone quite fast, actually. Are you ready for a song? I'm going to get... My DJ Shimmy to help me. We're going to do the song. This one's for the younger ones, but of course, the old ones can join in. Do you know the song? Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give a little. We're going to do that, this song, but it's a bit different. After we've done the clap, clap and everything, we're going to go forwards and back. Forwards and back. And we're going to be happy and sad. Ooh, happy. And sad. Woo. Can you do that? You're gonna do the actions when I put the, when DJ Shimmy puts the music on. Then we're gonna do hot and cold. Hot and cold. So cold. And then we're gonna do yes and no. Yes and no. Can you do that? You're gonna do these actions with me. Then we're gonna do good morning and good night. Good morning and good night. Yeah? DJ Shimmy, could you be so kind as to try and put the music on? I know you're get, just getting used to the new keyboard still. You've only had it, how long? Three days? You still haven't got used to it? Let me help you out. Okay, there. Good. So, are you ready? We're going to do the open shut them song. Yeah, that button. That button, that button. Yeah, 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 yeah. Press it, press it. Yes. Well done. So I'm going to see your hands. You're going to open, shut them. Where are they? You're open and shut. 
open shut them, open shut them, give a little clap, 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 open shut them, open shut them, put them in your lap, 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 now we're going to go forwards and back, can you do that? Forwards, back, forward and back, forward, 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 back, back, back. Forward and back, forward and back, forward, 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 back, back, back. Now happy, happy. and sad. <laughs> happy and sad, happy and sad, happy, 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 sad, sad, sad. Happy and sad, happy and sad, happy, 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 sad, sad, sad. Don't be sad. Now we're going to be hot and cold, hot and cold, hot and cold, hot, 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 hot. cold, 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 Woo. hot and cold, hot and cold, hot, 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 cold, cold, cold. Yes. Now yes and no, yes and no, yes and no. Yes, 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 no, no, no. Yes and no. Yes and no. Yes, 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 no, no, no. No. Good morning. Good morning. Good night. Good morning. Good morning. Good night. Good morning. Good night. Good morning. Good night. Good morning. Good morning. Good night. Good morning. Good night. Good morning, good night. Good morning, morning. Good night. Boom. Oh, who said that? Wake up. Wake up, wake up. Don't go to sleep. Don't go to sleep. Wait, turn off the music, DJ. Thank you. Just in time. <laughs> Do you know that song? Did you like that song? Even the older ones, you can join in with the song. <laughs> Okay, that was our song for today. Now I'm going to tell you one more riddle joke and then we're going to do the goodbye song. Yeah? You ready for that? Hmm, which one can I do for you? Aha, this one. What do you call an alligator? You know what an alligator is? You do? It's like a crocodile, but is it bigger or smaller? I think it's smaller, probably bigger. Okay. What do you call an alligator wearing a vest? The vest is like something you wear under your clothes, like a t-shirt thing under your clothes. Have you ever seen an alligator wearing a vest? What do you call an alligator wearing a vest? I don't know. What do you call yourself? And in investigator an investigator <laughs> that was terrible wasn't it so terrible but some some of you might not even know what that that even means an investigator an alligator yes alex got that right <laughs> you did know what that meant <laughs> yes you did too anoa an investigator it's a terrible joke isn't it if you know better jokes please send them to me Sherry, what children really want. You can get me on Facebook or even here on, on YouTube. Like and subscribe. Always forget to say that. Like and subscribe. <laughs> if you already liked and subscribed, thank you very much. If you haven't, don't worry. You can do it now <laughs> or any other time. Or you don't even have to do it. No problem. Are you ready for the goodbye song? We're going to say goodbye to everybody and you guys enjoy this special day because it's not finished yet. So you still enjoy it. It's still time to enjoy it. Okay. DJ Shimmy, can you put on the goodbye song? Yes, I can. Don't dance out your energy. You still got a little bit of energy left in you. Let's dance it out. Bye bye, girls and boys. Bye bye, girls and boys. Bye bye, girls and boys. Bye bye, everyone. For all of you. Yes, you. All of you. Every single one of you. See you next time. See you next time. See you next time. Bye bye, everyone. Thank you so much. 
So you go and have yourself a nice Sunday. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Can you do that for me? Yeah? And for yourselves. More importantly, to do it for yourselves. Mwah. Goodbye from DJ Shimmy and me, Sherry. See you next time.